Hi, Miss Deb here, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to blend colors with dry medium, which means colored pencils, crayons, oil pastels, dry pastels, and markers. We are not going to use anything that we need to use water with. So in this video, we are going to show you how to blend colors with all these mediums. I'm going to show you a color wheel where it will show you all the primary colors, secondary colors, and the analogous colors. Analogous colors means the colors that are next to each other. So you can choose any colors that are next to each other and you can blend them nicely and it will look awesome. There are also some colors are called cool colors, which usually have blues, and the one that has yellows are called warm colors. So greens and purples, they can be both cool colors and warm colors depending on how much blues or yellows it has. You will see if you choose any kind of um, analogous colors, you can blend them and your artwork will look awesome. You can go from yellow to light green to dark green to blue or from green to blue to purple or from yellow to orange to red you will see i am keeping the same direction when i am blending the colors and i am not blend i'm not ending one color in a straight line my uh, pencil marks or crayon marks are jaggedy and they are overlapping each other that makes your blending even smoother and your artwork will look good even better but here I, I'm showing you the dry pastels and I'm going to show you how to do uh, blend colors in circles. So from peach to pink to purple, you will see I'm going from the center of the circle outward. What will happen is it will look blended and it will look like as if there's a burst of colors. Do not leave any gaps and overlap colors when you're changing from one color to the other. What will happen is it will look even more realistic and the blending would, would be smoother. So that's how you blend. Happy creating!